What kind of graphic designer will you become? So this week marks the final week for our internship class. 10 weeks ago, I started with the first question of what kind of graphic designer did you want to be? And hopefully this has gotten you started to think about yourself and the kind of work you do as a professional. Being a graphic designer is more than just what you do on a computer. It's more than software. It's more than making pretty pictures. We've talked on topics such as how to find a job and things you should put into your portfolio. You know now what clients are looking for in terms of your creativity, in terms of time management and how to communicate with people. You get a better understanding of what it means to be a freelance designer. You know how to budget and how to plan for an annual salary or an hourly rate. And this week's topic is on production basics and how to handhold your client through the entire process of getting their work produced. But above all, I hope you've understand that being a professional designer means taking responsibility for all aspects of your life. If you're a student now, you're taking responsibility for your education. But once you graduate, are you still going to be a student? Do you still want to learn and know more about this profession? Are you going to take responsibility for your community? Are you going to find ways of giving back to people who've given so much to you? Are you going to take responsibility for yourself? Are you going to grow yourself? Are you going to treat yourself as a business? Are you going to find ways of investing back into yourself? So asking the question of what kind of graphic designer you want to be, that's the easy question. But what kind of graphic designer do you want to become? Hopefully you'll continue asking yourself that question for your entire career.